Good morning. We're just doing, um, I'm basically sorry about that. Basically started already, guys. I'm just doing the finishing touches, not doing much. Just lashes, lipstick, of course, the foundation and stuff like that. How's everybody this morning? Ready to start this day, y'all. Sorry about the glare. It's that light in the back. Just trying to get through the first day of the work week. <clears throat> this was the LA Colors Matte Lipstick and... They say it's matte, but it doesn't really feel like a matte. It doesn't really look dry like a matte, but I just put it on. Um, the color is dramatic. And I'm going to be putting on the LA Color, one of my favorite um, Diva eyelashes. I'm so angry. I got an email last night when I ordered that. The name of the glue, nail glue, I was telling you guys in the Dollar Tree haul last night. It's made by Nailene. And, um, couldn't find it anywhere in stores. And they told me it would be here, um, today. Well, it's not coming till next Tuesday. I'm, I'm not happy about that. That's not the first time that's happened with Walmart with the two-day shipping, they tell you. And then you get an email. <clears throat> but being that I can't find it anywhere else, I'm going to wait. I don't like the Kiss Nail Glue. I don't think that's any better. But then again, I've had my hands in a lot of water with the laundry and stuff like that. Get my domestic on. I got an inbox last night from someone who was more active in the cyber family and they wanted to know, you know, will I be doing more junior videos or why don't I do more junior videos or something like that. And it's not that I don't follow the case. I do. I follow Jake on Instagram and I follow Felice Justice. And whatever comes on the news, I still follow. I, I just, you know, to do a video, just to do a video. I, I'm not going to do a video on something. I have to, um, I'm just not going to put a video out for views. I'm just not going to put a video out for junior. I'm not going to lie. My junior videos get the most views. I started out on YouTube doing Dollar Tree hauls. Okay. Maybe I did a wig video and stuff like that. Um, and then the junior thing happened. I mean, I was doing Dollar Tree hauls and I would have not many views. I think my highest view haul was a hundred and something. And I was okay with that. Um, I'm just not going to do a junior video. Just, you know, I have other things that I can talk about. Other things that I want to talk about doesn't mean that I forgot about him. I see him every day because... Like I said, I follow those people, so it's on my timeline. And um, there's really, as far as I'm concerned, nothing going on. The piss boy, I think, was in court yesterday. He's the one who um, threw piss at one of the correction officers. He was in court yesterday. I think they got a DNA swab from him. And then um, on Halloween, someone else is in court. Listen, the trial didn't begin yet, y'all. And in my opinion, nothing has really changed. So for me to do a junior video, um, what am I going to talk about? We've talked about almost everything. I don't do videos just to do videos, you know. It has to come from my heart. And when people had asked me to talk about other things, um, like the young lady who was 
Naya Wilson, the one who was stabbed at the train station. I did a video on it, but I, that's not me. I'm not a, um, a news reporter. You know what I mean? There are some people that their YouTube channel is dedicated to 100% current events, what's going on and stuff like that. That's not what my channel is about. It's just that when that junior thing happened, I mean, come on, we all got caught up. Sorry. <clears throat> we all got caught up, you know what I mean? I should have did this while I'm sitting here running my mouth. Dollar Tree, if you don't know it by now, that's my love. Shopping is my love, to be honest with you. Makeup, wigs, that is my love. It's easier to talk about something you love. I'll give you a perfect example. I have an aunt. She's also a nurse. Okay. She's involved in um, Five Links. Okay, I don't know if you guys heard about Five Links. Um, and she wanted me to, I guess, sell stuff. I don't know if this is going to be a copyright song, guys. Hold on. Let me pause. She wanted me to come on, I guess, and sell things. And it was like getting people to change their cable over. It was getting people to uh, change their light bill over. Selling this um, coffee that is healthier for you, promotes weight loss. A whole bunch of shit. That's not me. You're a nurse. Why do you want to do that? I mean, in nursing, I'm not a commission salesperson, okay? There's some people that come to YouTube to make money because they need to, um, they want to make this a career. They want to make this their sole income earning. Um, I need guaranteed money, okay? As a nurse, I can make guaranteed money. As a nurse, she can make guaranteed money. She has spent hours trying to get people to sign on. And you're a nurse. You have a degree. You can go and make... I mean, listen, if you do visiting nursing, sometimes you'll get paid $100 a visit. If you visit five people, that's $500 in one day. Why would I want to be begging people to buy stuff, spending hours with them, and if they don't buy, I make no money, and I can go somewhere and make guaranteed money. I'm a guaranteed money type of girl, okay? Now, YouTube, it's for shits and giggles, okay? I have a good time. I like sharing with people. I've met some really cool people. But I... I'm not thinking that YouTube could be my sole source of income. If I can make a couple of coins to go to Dollar Tree, okay. But I'm not looking at, I'm waiting for this YouTube check to pay for uh, my next vacation or a car payment or um, rent. That's not me. I, I can't take gambles with major life stuff like that, okay. I what we were talking about, y'all. <laughs> Forgot why I brought that up. But, oh, it has to be from my heart. Okay? When I did the junior videos, it was from my heart because I was truly upset. Um, I was hurting for the family, for him. It has to come from my heart. If it doesn't come from my heart, I can't do it. I'm not a phony baloney like that. If I'm not feeling something, I'm not feeling something. I can't pretend. So it doesn't mean that I don't care. It doesn't mean that I forgot. I haven't. I still... I follow, um, like I said, Felice Justice. And I follow um, Jake. I like his Instagram page. And that's it, y'all. You know? But if something major happens, we can talk about it. It's just that right now we're waiting for the trial to start. You know what I mean? You know, what is there to talk about? Um, 
the what ifs, um, you know, how nobody helped him. We talked about that already. It was kind of consuming me, y'all. It really was. I was caught up and I could not devote my concentration to anything else. It cons- I mean, it was affecting home life, work life. So I had to step away. Shout out to the people who, you know, still can talk about it every day. It's always one, y'all. I've seen these eyelashes on IG where the glue is already there. You wet it, and I guess it becomes sticky. You put it on your eye, then you take it off, put them away. When you want to use them again, you wet it again, and then you can put them back on. The only thing with buying stuff off of Instagram and Facebook, I have gotten screwed. And I know they say free trial, but you're going to have to pay for shipping. And, um... Nothing's completely free. And I just have gotten screwed before. You know what I mean? So I'm really kind of nervous and leery about ordering things from Instagram and Facebook. you follow me to a place Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. I'm gonna do a video with the LA colors makeup I just can't experiment in the morning not especially when I need to be on time you know just in case I put that on my face and I don't like it I can't I can't really take those chances in the morning so I will do a video but it's going to be, you know, later in the day. But that's about it. I was cracking up listening um, to uh, the Cardi B and Nicki Minaj. Um, I don't know if you guys follow them. I'm not really music fans of them. Don't get me wrong. I like a couple of Cardi B songs. But I'm not fans. I can't say I would go to their concerts or I would purchase music from them. Um, I'll just listen to it free. But um, it's just... I think Nicki Minaj is jealous of her. I think she is. And, you know, you're older. You're established. I mean, let the girl eat, okay? She's doing well. Let her eat. I think she's jealous of her. And, you know, I don't see it any other way. I don't care what anybody else says. And I just was listening to the Instagram rant that Cardi went on. And it's hard. When people lie on you, it's hard not to respond. Like the false prophet saying that I've said things about a child that I didn't even know existed, that's that's kind of upsetting. I've said enough negative stuff about you that if you want sympathy from people, you could tell them that those things, but don't lie. So I understand how she feels. You want to clear your name, but me personally, after that night on the live, I'm not trying to clear my name. I know. And he knows. That's why he, he removed that live. How do you go from praying for people to uh, telling me to go eat a box of donuts and, and calling me fat. I mean, and, and lying like that. But you know what? He has his followers and people will believe what they want to believe. It's sad, but some people have to lie. They have to, um, that all was to create content because he has nothing to talk about, to be honest with you. He has nothing to talk about. You know, if it ain't talking about Junior, he has nothing to talk about. So he needs to create drama and all of that. I mean, but it is upsetting when people blatantly lie on you. But I'm not entertaining that BS anymore. 
So please don't bring it to me. I'm not entertaining it. I have a life. I have other things going on. But to worry about an individual who has nothing else to do with himself. And um, so I understand why Cardi went on Instagram to try to clear her name. But you can't, you can't reason with people. Especially narcissists and crazy people. You can't reason with them because they believe their own lies. Okay, they believe their own lies and trying to reason with them, you only wasting your time. So whatever, whatever. Hold on, guys. I don't know if that's copyright music. I got to go through the list of YouTube safe copyrighted music, but it might not be music I like, so I don't know. I also need to get to the beauty supply after work because I'm running low on a few things. Try not to stop at Dollar Tree. Try, I said. These longer units, they just tangle towards the end. I really I'm gonna be looking for me some new wigs. I seen a couple on YouTube that I want to check out. I just hate paying full price for them. But I can't depend on my clearance. Spot, you know what it is? The online prices are cheaper than if you went to a beauty supply store. Seriously, by almost 50%. The problem is the shipping for most of those sites is very expensive. You know what I mean? $12 shipping. But you do get the unit pretty quickly. I mean, you get it next day, so... I mean, sometimes you have to spend. It's the only thing I hate about this hair. This is annoying. I really don't like hair in my eye. And with this unit, the swoop is annoying. Let me see if I can tuck it a little bit. Just to keep it out of my eye. But then it doesn't tick away from the style, so I don't know. I just hate the swoop in my eye. It just, it's just annoying. And if I haven't told you guys already, which I know I have, the Lusty um, Edge Gel from Dollar Tree. I used to buy cream of nature. I used to buy that olive oil edge gel. I'm telling you. This stuff is good. I re highly recommend this. If you see it in your Dollar Tree. Now that knockoff of the Gorilla gl Snot Glue. I wouldn't waste my money. My dollar. I'm going to get some mousse, y'all. See, this makes me feel like I'm a Leah. The hair and the eye, I don't like. Somebody had said they didn't know that you could put product on wigs. Yes, you can. I mean, don't get me wrong. 
you got to be careful because it will build up and you'll have to wash the wig just like in your hair. You put a lot of product in your hair. You have to wash your hair. It builds up. God, it's shedding. I'm going to do something with this swoop, y'all. But everybody have a great day. I intend to. Operation Freedom. If you got to work, get in, get out. And uh, thanks for hanging out with me. And I will see you guys soon.